Sharon Rammel with you from the not quite so humble couch from my stool here in my office. As winter descends, we are going to be looking at our base chakra, Muladhara, and in the middle of this, do a brief mantra meditation with the word lamb. We are all responsible for what we do for and for what we do not do. So often we see that times during life, opportunities are presented and we can decide whether to work on them or to rid ourselves of the contents of our unconsciousness and remain captured in the wheel that we believe is our destiny. However, we have a way forward. Often there are three paths. Keep on doing what you're doing. Choose a worse one or a better one. And meditation and yoga are two of the best tools that you can use in order to take the step forward, to sift through the contents of your unconsciousness with complete and utter awareness. For in the silence, the gems emerge. Now the seed mantra for Muladhara, our base chakra, is lamb. It releases tension. It removes blockages. And this chakra has the ability to activate, to really pump up our energy. Some of the great methods that we can help to think about are to reflect on the feelings produced during this. Now, it's very handy to have a sankalpa or an aim, a right intention, a simple work of making a favorable resolution to remove any doubts, to discard false ideas, and there are many that come into our heads, to be conscious of the divine self, that you are a divine spark of the God Goddess, and the more clarity we gain, the more aware we are of our shortcomings, feelings of inferiority that do not assist us, they rob us of our vitality. However, we have the ability to learn from our mistakes, to go on the path with faith, living with God, Goddess, knowing we are a spark of the divine, and within we gain the strength. We become better able to cope with anything that life throws up at us. And this happens, my friends, from within the silence of your inner experience. It is essential that we release negative thought patterns. They simply hold us back. They hinder us. It is time for us all to choose to foster, to cultivate beneficial, positive ways forward of thinking. Leave this and live from your radiant heart. For the meditation side, come into either Anjali Mudra or the Mudra of Receptivity. You're going to receive your breath three times and exhale. And then we are going to chant the mantra LAM, which I've said before is the Bijou or seed for Muladhara, our base chakra. You can, if you like, also hold your hand in a triangular symbol to really symbolize and focus on Muladhara. It's up to you, but be comfortable either laying on the floor, sitting on your couch, preferably with your back upright, although if it needs to be supported, please do so. Or if you're on a stool like me, again, feet seated, or if you're on the floor, your favorite cross-legged position. But this does not need to be difficult, okay? Because what we are doing here is trying to relax ourselves, engage deeply the threads of our life with our Mother Earth, so that we bring a sense of peace and tranquility flooding up through the core of our beings. Are you ready? Inhaling. Exhale. <sighs> Make any sound you want. Just let it go. Inhaling. <sighs> One more. Inhaling. Ah. <sighs> 
Inhaling. Get quieter. Keep breathing. And now just send them quietly inside your body. Again, inhale. If you have closed your eyes, roll your shoulders back, open them and come back to me. If you've been doing this as a total awareness immersion meditation, smile deeply inside and thank yourself for being here today. Aho. Om Shanti, Shanti, Shanti.